the sun this morning. Where's that lad going? Where's he going? There's Craig's van all done up. Spotless. That was uh, bent and that was broken. The bumper had a bit of a bang on it. From the time the deers attacked us. And we figured out something this morning. If I sleep it out, we're both late. Because we have this thing. When you wake up in the morning, you ring me. And when I wake up, I ring you. I ring Greg every morning. That one morning I sleep it out. Because I'm getting about three hours sleep a night. Uh, we sleep it out. This is a cunt. <sighs> you ready? Hey, I didn't have any lunch today, so I said I'd get some in. Where is it? Bottom grass. And uh, I want to watch your back in Fisher's because I fucking... I did the finestation and I made the huge mistake of asking her what sauces she had. She was not happy. She goes like this. It rattled her. <sighs> <laughs> she was fucking bullied, mate. Well, it's not all bad. The lady behind the counter taking the money was lovely. And the one making food was lovely. But by God, someone got up in the bed to say to the bed, didn't they? Don't claim wrong, I have a bad day. I have one today myself. Oh, yeah. Why are you having a bad day, David? Why? Yeah. It's bad. I don't know. I woke up the wrong side of bed. Because I slept out. Someone wasn't there for me to wake me up. And let me down. Who was meant to wake? I think there's a... An etiquette. If I sleep it out, you wake me. And if you sleep it out, yeah. I wake you. But I was busy. I was busy this morning. morning. Okay, there you just, go. I never thought. There you go. You let me down. I did let you down. You let me down. <laughs> so I figured out that the morning time is the perfect time to do a bit of greasing, fill it with urea, fill it with diesel, because uh, horse flies and flies are lazy bastards and they don't get up in the morning. It shoots me grand because I'm sick of getting bit by horse flies. Now flies don't bite you, but they land on you and they. They lick you and stuff and they also lick cow shite, dog shite, any kind of shite really and I have no time for that. I have no time for that. Greg's down there cutting. The next block. I will try and finish that today. Hopefully I will. Uh, thanks a million for all the comments, the nice comments, all the beautiful comments about the podcast. Appreciate it. And uh, about Alan's one as well. You're all so fucking sound. You're all so sound. Well, I'm just, uh, I'm just busy. Sorry, I ran out of time. Like I said, just, just busy. And I do still live in the real world. So, I will get back to you all eventually. In fact, tonight, I am. Tonight, I'm going back to the office and I get back to people. I'm a little bit behind on my emails and stuff, but I should catch up by the scene. It's just I'm doing so much because I'm so productive. I'm such a productive man, do you know what I mean, bye? You know what I mean? It's just getting silly, isn't it? Don't fleas. Don't fleas. And look at this dickhead. I hate horse fleas. He wants to get in there too. He is mad for my Mickey. Jack. Play Jack. Jack and do it, please. All night long. We actually couldn't get into the van. It's so warm. It's too warm. Craig uh, had the fucking intelligence to leave it in the shade. Then it was shady, but then he cut the whole thing down. It's all gone. Because we're so productive. You know, Greg, I really been enjoying these beautiful sun rises on these beautiful drives in this beautiful van with you in the morning. Romantic, isn't it? Very. You know, this set, how I'm feeling right now, every morning, I don't know how we
we have pulled up this van and drove our meat up each other's arses. <laughs> oh, Jesus, this is some van. It's nice. You're loving it. Yeah, loving it. It's quicker. Grandson. Grandson. Of course, me and Greg won't actually be driving our Mickey's up each other's arses. That was a joke, it was a term of endearment. There's nothing behind it. If I got a horn smart, we're not gonna do with him. And if he got a horn, we're not gonna do with me. He'd be thinking of his beautiful wife, and I'd be thinking of my beautiful wife. And we wouldn't be talking or thinking about each other's beautiful wives. Cause that's disgusting. Isn't that right, Greg? Disgusting. I have a big bird problem. You have a big bird problem? No, a little bird. Is it really? Yeah. I don't have crows. Oh, I cross hair to them. They do, but the third cross sound terrible. They're like, ah! Ah! The little birds are these going, tweet, 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 tweet. It's all nice. There's a big difference. There's a big difference, a big fucking difference. You can just slow in the morning. Yeah. A bit like you yesterday morning. I was slow yesterday morning. Better you know. <laughs> you slipped out your past. I, I had half a day's work done before I got down to you. Stop. Stop. I put my oh. treasure on my face tomorrow. You did that? I thought someone was up jizzing on your forehead because you didn't rub it in right. I didn't. Great, great click to me. There was a little bit of stuff there. It looked like someone had... Uh, he's telling me it was my treasure. It's great. There was no one in my house fit the jizz. Are you not, no? <laughs> I suppose I am. I suppose I am. I just have the energy. Just busy. Just too busy. This van was grand for tipping around the mountain, right? This van was grand? No, it was grand for tipping around the mountain, but when we're the big boys getting in and doing two hours of driving in the morning, two hours of driving in the evening, you need something with a little bit more je ne sais quoi. No, a transport. A little bit more. Right what? Transport won't be big enough. Transport's not big enough, this. So. You know. I'm just looking forward to Jay this morning down in Bald Blast. Oh, I'm nearly afraid going down now. Nearly afraid. See, I made, I made the mistake. See, we're fierce friendly in the morning. Maybe we're all friendly. Well, I did walk in and I was there. Hello, good morning, how are you? Like a wrap? Brown or white? This is a uh, brown. So she turned around, she got her wrap and then she slapped it down the counter and she says, what sauces would you like? I was there, um, what have you got? She goes, <sighs> turned around, rolled her eyes up the head. She was like, <laughs> oh, I a bit embarrassed and uh, I thought I was the only one that noticed that there was a guy in front of Greg, a builder, and he was like this. And Greg, you were, Greg was fit to be tied. Oh, I was <laughs> just Greg, Greg, I didn't know did why you not think I was being bullied? Why you'd upset her so much? I should look, not a lot of people like getting up early in the morning. I'd say it's hard to get staff. It's uh, them shops. I would say it's Tell easy. Tell me about. Fuck you, Greg. <laughs> Are they here, aren't they? I don't fucking enjoy it when I'm here. <laughs> you know, thank God that when I get here in the morning I have to fill with diesel and grease the machine and fill it with ab blue and that. Because I'd be wrecked when I get out of the van. So it wakes me up a bit. Sleeping patterns are just a disaster at this time. My own fault. I say every morning, I'm gonna go to bed early. I'm gonna go to bed early tonight. But you know, leave here two hours home back to the office, do a few orders, answer a few emails, get home. And then next thing you know, it's half 12 and you're lying in the bed chatting to Vicky about the day. Not up writing, although I wouldn't turn it down, but it's not up to me. So I need to get my shit together. I need to get my shit together. Because, uh, it'll bite me in the arse. I need to get more organized. Like Derek Murray would say, David! You lack detail. Fuck you, Derek, right? Big, big fucking chance of getting employee of the month again this month. Going above and beyond again. Everyone's getting sick of me at work because I keep winning it, but I just keep performing. After ordering the breakfast, then, we... Did you ever hear that saying, your eyes are bigger than your belly? Hey, that's only the size of my hand. Ooh, I want fat cunt, boy. I wasn't expecting that. And so am I. Okay, 
can't be kept in Ocra. Oh. People are robbing at the blink of an eye, full of hoops and balls. So lock them into the cages. I think we definitely need a sawman for this block, don't we? What? Answer me when I'm talking to you, I'll put your head through the fucking wall. I don't have to talk to you. Greg, pick a window! Power washing here the other day, maybe it was already a little bit wet. Look at you the way you stand, Greg. Like a bouncer all the time. Barry's very casual. And look, Barry you're, looks like you're only modeling. doing this to get my clothes. I'm not doing you yet. <laughs> Just yeah. the only reason you're doing this. I wouldn't show anyone that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm home, and this, this lad is a little angel. He's as quiet as a mouse. So he is. <laughs> Definitely takes after me. He's just so timid, calm, quiet. That's the exact image Fluffy. of him. <laughs> was he in the bouncing castle? Yeah, I was chewing water on them. Did he throw water on you? No. He was, I saw it put the water on the clock. It is his side goes down the slide, then him stink. He stinks? Yeah. Why? Full of wet. Full of wet water. Water is normally wet. Was Lily good to you today? No. I pulled my hair. Lily, but... No, I didn't. She yanked my hair. She wouldn't let did, go for a good five minutes. Did she pull your hair? Yes. Why are you lying? No, I didn't. You were the one that pulled my hair. Did you pull her hair? No, who pulled my you hair? You pulled my hair for a good solid five minutes. All right. No, who has disgusting feet? Do you like my shoes? You have disgusting feet, she said. No, I don't. I have lovely feet. Thank you very much. Are your feet disgusting? Yeah. No one would pay to get a picture of your feet. Lily, will you do me a favour? Hey! Don't be smacking. Oh. That's not very nice. So were you good today though, were you? Yes. Did you miss me yesterday? Yes. Yeah? I didn't miss you because I think you're stinky. I just, look, I just, just dry myself. You just had a shower. So you smell nice. I Do you like the ball, Connor? No. Why? Because it's bald. I don't like that ball. And why do you be bald all the time then? This is a kitchen. That's a kitchen. This is not the ball corner. This is the ball corner. No, the ball corner is over there where I always put you. And you'll be going in there again if you stay being bald. That one, this is not a ball corner. This is not a ball corner. This is the ball corner. Hey, the ball corner is wherever I want it to be because I'm the boss. You're not the boss. You is the boss. I am the boss. And then, Mommy's boss and you are the boss. Yeah, who else is the boss? Mommy and you. Is Lily the boss? No. What? Lily's my boss. Mommy said no. And Mommy's boss and you are the boss. Is Clark the boss? No. So, do you have to do what Lily says? Yes. So, does that mean Lily's your boss? Yes. You're two Egypts. You're just jealous you can never look as good as us. And Dave knows it. Isn't that true, Jay? Yep. Do you want to do that lip gloss? Because he said he wanted lip gloss earlier. No, I don't need it. Why don't you? Yeah, just because you're godparents doesn't mean you can take him home. Oh. But you can have him for a couple of nights while me and Vicky get busy again. Hey, Matt. Matt. Look at Garrett lying in there. Look, look at Garrett in there lying. Look at him. Look at him. Talking shite. Yeah. Big Uncle Martin. Hey, John. <laughs> 
Sean was supposed to do a podcast with me this weekend yeah. about leaving one year into a 10 year course, which he did do. Yep. And we were going to do a podcast about that, and now he's like, oh no, I have to go back Too up buzzy. the north. I have to go back up the north. You need some bright up there. <laughs> You're going back tonight? Beer. Oh, nice beard. Greg's beard is no, fucking. Yeah. Tidy beard. That is as nice a beard as you're gonna get, buddy.